I um, uh, pre-ordered a uh, Wind Waker for GameCube. Mm -hmm. You know, did the midnight release thing, sort of line, got a little extra little watch, it was really cute. The best part was, I, um, didn't have a GameCube yet. So, so you, you pre-ordered and bought the game. Bought the game, did not have a GameCube. Hello everyone, my name is Josh, aka the Biscuit Eater, and I want to welcome you all to another episode of my long form let's play of Stardew Valley modded with friends. Yeah, it goes. Now, if this is your first time of the series, you know you can find a link to the playlist in the description down below. Yeah, that's if you're on YouTube, of course, if you're watching live on stream, we appreciate having you here, as always, and hope to uh, see you again. If you'd like to join us and you haven't had a chance yet, do know you can find us every Monday and Wednesday from 7.30 p.m. to 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time here at twitch.tv forward slash the Biscuit Eater. Hope to see you there. With that all said, let's go ahead and finish out uh, our night here. And uh, you've got flashing tile in your hands. <laughs> I do. All right, so time is running. We have an empty spot here, so we've got to... Emerald. Aha. Okay. All right. So, what's on the docket for today's episode? Uh, well, we need to do a question. Oh yes. Let's. And yep. We can. First. Okay. Question. We can do question first. So. Because uh, we skipped the question yesterday, well, not yesterday, but last episode. Um, have you ever skipped an adulting task for the release of something? And I can actually honestly state that while I have never actually intentionally skipped something for an adulting task, um, I took advantage of a... Uh, local weather issue to try to play the um when, when uh, I, I used to be really into world of warcraft and when the burning crusade expansion came out i was like i really wanted to play it so i kind of called out sick but then i had to ride into town right near my work to pick up a co my copy. Problem is, the day of release, there was a major snowstorm. So I spent almost uh, three and a half hours on a one and a half hour uh, train ride to get downtown to find out that everything downtown had shut down. Oops. So my release copy of the Burning Crusade, because again, this is before digital uh, di only distribution really was a thing, was stuck in the GameStop where I pre ordered it for another, oh, three, four, five days before I could actually get to it. So I called out sick to play the game, and I couldn't play the game. Serves me right. Totally serves me right. I recognize that. But yeah. How about you, Raz? Um. I did do a midnight release for a game, and definitely, like, was rough the next morning, so I didn't really skip the adulting task, but I, you know, made the adulting task harder. <laughs> I, um. Uh, pre-ordered uh, Wind Waker for GameCube. Mm -hmm. 
you know, did the midnight release thing, stood in line, got a little extra little watch, it was really cute. The best part was, I, um, didn't have a GameCube yet. So, so you pre-ordered and bought the game. Bought the game, did not have a GameCube. That's... I got one shortly after. Um, also, but I also had a, my, my, my boyfriend had a GameCube, so if I was in his dorm, I could play, <laughs> but if I was at home, I could not play. So, not the smartest thing I've done, but not the dumbest. <laughs> what about you over there, Mr. Nathan? Um, sorry, I got sucked into a, uh... Uh, playable cutscene because apparently I got a heart of it with uh, with uh, Abigail, so I'm playing the. Oh yes, yeah, play your thing. Okay, that's done. So, man, I I don't think I actually have. I could have wanted to, but. You know, being poor, you don't really have that luxury. Um, and now it's like I could, but I don't. I like there's nothing coming out now that I would actually take time off for to play. Um, like if Elder Scrolls Six ever comes out, that might be a contender. But yeah, but that won't be until uh, 20, 2053, so... It's not going to be until after I'm dead. <laughs> yeah. The parenting, adulting task. I, I think it's primarily focused on work as a adult, the uh, adulting task in question. But, uh... You know, playing hooky. Look who's all Mr. Responsible and stuff. Oh my god, I've just been in my house this whole time? Yeah, you've just been in your house this whole time, ignoring us. I see how hey. it is. Look. Yeah. So okay. So it's two fifty in game. Uh, what was we need? We still need more coal. So I'm gonna run over to the mines for just a little bit. Try to get us some. Oh, we've got blackberries. Oh, blackberry season. And I blackberries I sell sell for three times as much now. I think I've got that too. Okay. We did all, all the did though do a midnight release of Oblivion, I think it was. Oh, yeah. Tracks. I really haven't done many midnight releases. Um, I think Fallout Four was the, was the last midnight release I did. No, it, it no, it was Skyrim. Skyrim, eleven years ago was the last midnight release I did. Oh, don't tell me it was that long ago. Yep, 11, 11, 11. Yep, yep. Oh, that's my problem. Okay. Oh, so I thought Dustmites were until 79, not... Not uh, 61. Unless it's a special level. This is definitely not an ice level. Right, if I go down a few more levels and it's still this weird stone type stuff, I'll have to go back. Oh, that's a special level. So I want to mine everything and 
No, I mean, that, it's just, it's just like this one, like, uh, it's like a randomly generated level that you can get. Ah. Put that over there. Yes, I know I'm taking long to get through. I'm looking for my... I'm looking for my tunnel. Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel. Oh, hi there, Skullzy. Ow. You're rude. I don't like you. And so you die. to personal I need to grab some food because I forgot to grab food. Yes, I want to eat my pizza. Thank you. Okay, so I did that all day. <laughs> oh, I see. All right. Did you, did you, is, are you happy with your house now? Yeah. Why don't you grab a second one of those? We had one already, Nathan. Really? Yeah, it's like, it's right here underneath the telephone. <laughs> oh, that was, okay. He asked if we already bought one, I thought we hadn't. I, I, oh, I, did I just zone oh, well, out while I was decorating? Well, I thought that was the clothes catalog. No, it wasn't. That was that was the wallpaper catalog, wasn't it? Yep. Okay, that's, that's, that, that's on me. That's on me. We can have more than one. It's not a big deal. Well, then I'll just take, just take it. Yeah, take it into your house, it'll make it easier to decorate. Stupid ghost. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Bait up, bait up, bait up. Which, by the way, I actually saw that in the theater. The new Ghostbusters. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's the first movie I've seen in the theater since uh, the pandemic started. And although I'm not going to be doing it again anytime soon, well, I should say I'm not going to be sitting in regular seating anytime soon. I now at this point, if I ever go to see another movie in the theater, which I want to see Spider-Man: No Way Home in the theater, I really do. I'm probably going to basically. I'm going to. I'm, I'm going to pretty much demand a, uh, a handicap seat. I've got the. I've got the disability. I've tried not. I've tried to hold off doing it. Pride and all that. But I was in a theater that was mostly unpopulated, and with reserved seating, I mean, you you actually request your your seating when you go into the theater. And I still yeah. had someone decide to sit right next to me when there were three, or to reserve the seat right next to me. So they actually had to actively see I that I had reserved that spot, and that there were two, three empty seats next to them to where they chose to sit right next to me. That's annoying. And they spent the entire movie, they, as soon as the lights went down, their masks came off. And although, you know, I'm, I was non-confrontational, probably should have been, but I just did not want to deal with that garbage. You wanted to enjoy your movie. Yeah. I hear ya. <laughs> yeah, we went and saw Spider-Man. Um, I tried, like, again, I tried to, like, okay, like, well, I'm gonna give myself a couple of people between us and the next people, and it just filled in. So, I'm like... Now, do you guys do reser reserves, too, in yours, or...? Yeah, we do. And they even have, like, the nice recliners. Yeah, same. I mean, so there was yeah, some like... distance, at, at the very least, but... Yeah, I mean, it's not like the old stadium seating where you're just, like, right on top of each other. I mean, at least you're not, like, touching the elbows anymore. Yeah. It's just, yeah, I, I, I miss the theater. I mean, I used to go, it was part of my walking routine, at least two weekends, a, 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 two weekends a, a month, I would, I would go to the theater and watch a movie. It was part of my routine that this old global panini has uh, upended. Mm -hmm. And I miss it. I miss going to the theater. I mean, I'm not one of those snobs like, only, movies are only good to say, oh, no. that's, that's not me, but 
there is something to be said about just that experience and that feel. I mean, these movies, oh, yeah. that's, they're, they're designed to be seen on the big screen. They're, they're filmed and they're, yeah. they're formatted with that in mind. And I miss it horribly. But I'm also grateful for uh, uh, WB putting their movies on HBO Max on release date. Being able to see Matrix 4 when it came out well, instead of, you know, six months later. So long as their, as, as their artists get the same uh, profits, you know, you know, as long as the actors still get paid what they would for if that, if that view was a moviegoer. That's. Yeah. I mean, I totally understood why Scarlett Johansson uh, had had a, had a beef with uh, Disney when they put um, hers out straight to uh, straight to uh, straight to uh, VOD, and but they they only they only gave her um, streaming rates, which allowed them to completely reduce the opening. Because okay, streaming rates are, are based not on new release. Re new, not, not based on new release numbers. Streaming, no. Disney st streaming rates are based upon pre, uh, post-release contracting, and so the the, the cost per uh, the, the amount per view is significantly reduced, er, significantly reducing her earning potential. Because by also putting out in the theater, this meant it was less likely that people were going to, or also putting out on, on streaming, people were less likely to go see it in the theater. Mm -hmm. So I can understand. The yeah. frustration there. Yeah, and, and, and I totally get that. So as long as WB is playing nice, you know, as much as I enjoy the MCU... Oh, time is frozen still. When did time get frozen? Oh, wow. I did not I did not freeze time. Who froze time? Well, I, 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 didn't I don't think you unfroze it since we started. It's 6 p.m. Right. It's 6 p.m. So time, oh. time was moving. Uh, but I don't know. I did not freeze it. Interesting. Weird. How weird. Don't know when that happened. All right, I need like uh. Anyone in chat see when that happened? I mean, I could have done it. I don't know. But... Blame cap. Blame cap. I think that's fair. Blame Capita, Blame Capita. I remember Cap getting in so much trouble for introducing you to that movie. The South Park Bigger, Longer, and Uncut movie. Um, actually, come to think of it, he might have been his daughter's age now. <laughs> no, 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 no. He was in high school. He was in high school. So. Oops. Yeah. So where's the um, um, furniture? Uh, I have it in my house right now because of all the decorating I'm doing. But if you'd like to come borrow it, you can. I'm almost at the end. Yep, it's right here in the middle. So generous. This thing right here. Oh, right there, right there. Yeah, there. Yep, you can just right click on it and take it. Do, 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 do. If you can't, let me know. I'll just go drop it outside. No, I just want a race. Okay, no. I do not have TVs here. Uh, yeah, TVs are in a weird spot. I'm just trying to cook, dude. <laughs> What's going wrong? Oh. Ooh, I got another secret note. I found some good things by looking in the garbage cans on lucky days. Sometimes you'll find the dish of the day behind the saloon, usually fresh. For dessert, I'll check the Mulder's can for cookies. For treasures, check the cans by the Black Clifton Museum. So does that, uh, unlock, so does, uh, getting that unlocked, like, extra 
special uh, results from dumpster diving? I don't uh, know. No, I think that's just a... Uh, um, yeah, it's, it's a little bit of... of uh, it's telling you how uh, secrets you can get. Gotcha. So basically, good luck days affect what's in the trash, is basically what that's telling you. Okay. And that does make sense. Again with a super quick uh, change to, to miss. Okay, I probably have to head back after this one. Probably. Oh, I should go check the, uh, the beach. Okay, go back up top. Alright. Head back to bus stop. Yay. So for all that, I got us 23 coal. That's not really turn proving to be very... Mm. It's Monday. Oh, it is. Okay, we're not doing that one. What are, what are the two that we have? Uh, either 100 pineapples or 100 yams. I think we'll be better off doing 100 yams. Yes, I think By you're the correct. End, yeah, 21 days for 100 yams. We'll is, it, it is it just shipping, or do we have to grow, uh, grow and ship? Grow and ship. Okay. We can make it happen, though. I can... Since I slacked off all these last two two weeks, um, <laughs> rebuilding and remodeling my house, oh, making it, it is and ready. one o'clock. Yep. Going to sleep for the night. Mm -hmm. All right. So, well, while we wait for sleep to reach us, uh, let's go ahead and do our third quest, our third question of the night, which is, what is a childhood movie, either favorite movie or one that you remember fondly, that really has not aged well? Um, during our previous episode, we talked about uh, what was the movie that we mentioned that didn't age well. Oh, um, I'm already forgetting. Oh, oh, oh what pre-stream? Yeah, no, no, no. Um, we oh, we, oh. we mentioned it during the last episode. Um, uh, but I'll say one of the movies that I remember thinking was awesome growing up that does not, uh, does not hold up well at all is uh, Revenge of the Nerds. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that that the, the the whole the yeah the whole win of that <laughs> yeah how about, how about no that 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 you know, that and i mean there are there are there are other worse films from that era but actually just in general a lot of the 80s teen movies or you know pg that really shouldn't have been pg movies well, they're pg before pg 13 was invented correct and one week from today, we are holding the Stardew Valley Fair at the town square. Okay, so we need to make sure we get enough of our uh, gold star stuff. Which we do. Yep. Do we have yams in here? Alright. Okay. Okay, and... The coal, I'm putting the coal in, it's not gonna last very long. I'm putting, the, putting coal in the, uh... Smelting bin, because we have kind of neglected it. But yeah, we need a, we need a better way to get... Or a, a better, easier way to get ourselves some coal, because... Yeah. Getting in the way is the, 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 the coal maker. Yeah, that's a lot of... That's a lot of wood for one coal, though. Yeah, it is. Yep, yeah, harvest the ship 100 yam, so I'm gonna... Do the whole... Yep. Yeah. 
Let's do it all, all this again. What are you eyeing? I just, uh, bad aim. Gotcha. Let's see. Uh, let me get the grid up, because I need the grid. I will go ahead and... We probably need to buy some yam well, seeds, don't yeah. we? Yeah, buy some yam seeds and buy some speed grow. Okay. Like, equal amounts. And then you can also do, a uh, Control shift and like left click or right click and that'll make, let you buy like a boatload. Okie dokie. Running, run. Oh, let's get on the horse. <gasps> we had a mushroom tree, guys. We did? Yeah. How'd that happen? Uh, also, what is a mushroom tree? You ever had a mushroom tree? I've never had a mushroom tree. Yeah. They um, will grow in the fall sometimes. I will have to come see this yeah, after I'm done. And or spot, but it, I'll take it. Oh, cutscene. Stop telling me how to live my life. For those of you living here, free of charge until you finish school. It seems like you don't appreciate that at all. Like, well, you gave birth to me, so... Stop trying to make me feel guilty. I appreciate that you and Dad are helping me out, but expecting me to dress the way you want is ridiculous. I'm not a little girl anymore, Mom. You're right, I'm sorry. Is someone there? Run away! <laughs> you creeper! I swear, this house is haunted. Way to be creepy there, buddy. Creeper, creeper! Okay, so Yem seeds. So, control, shift. <laughs> that. Oh, I was like, the heck kind of sound is that? Alright, um... So I'm dropping it in. I, I, I was being a creeper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were sure. Oh, uh, is that the name? Is that the noise it used to make? It still makes. Okay. All right. So seeds are in the seed box. Okay. Do 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 do. All right, so I answered my film. What about you guys? Um, Ace Ventura. Yeah, yeah. There's definitely some uh, overt homophobia and transphobia in that one. That I, really yeah, doesn't translate definitely. well. It's just like, oh, oh man, I didn't do well. I think you stole mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, honestly, like, a lot of the movies of, of that time just, I'm like, that was just the thing, and, you know, that's not okay now, but... And it wasn't okay then, we just, we weren't as conscious of the, no. the effects of the microaggressions that we were hitting people with. And I say we, because I was very much part of that problem. And there are some things that I wrote and thought and said back then that make me cringe now. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I picked up the yams. Yeah, I didn't pick up the speed grow. Oh, yeah. I'll get the speed grow. Yeah, let me just jump. Well, okay. Oh. Okay, let me... I, I, you know, I can go get the speed no, that's grow. Okay. Right, I, I got it. I got it. Okay. You get, you get to planting, Missy. <laughs> Did you put them somewhere I can plant? Yeah, I put them in. I put them in the seed box. Okay. And I will go plant now that I've painted my house. Okay, got a hundred speed grow. I'm I'm taking the furniture catalog. 
Yeah, that's fine. I'm good for now. Yeah, I was letting you know, so like, wait, where did this go? Speed <laughs> grows yeah, with this. Speed grows in the, with the seeds as well. Okay. Well then, I will start planning. Do we want to shove sprinkler, sprinklers down there too, or do we want to try to mainly water all this? We should probably just sprinkler it. Okay. Well then, I must do that now before. We have extra sprinklers. There's one. How many spots do we have? more sprinkler. Uh, we need more radium? Battery packs. Ah. But it's raining tomorrow. Oh, there's that. Yep. So maybe we'll have some more. Yeah, yeah. Ten days, so that should take it a little easier. Okay, we'll just do wild seeds. Fire bar, cork, that way, huh? Yeah, we'll do sunflowers, why not? All the all the sounds of of farming. It's such farming, such sound. Uh, let me put the grid back on. So Nathan, is you said you felt she uh, took your your answer. Yeah. Um. Part of it is there's not a lot of films from my youth that I rewatched recently. To be able to say, oh yeah, this one totally sucks now, or, yeah. Are there none that you particularly remember, or? Uh, it's been decades since I've watched any of them. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say it, all of the uh, uh, Ernest movies. Yes. I, I, I loved me some Ernest movies when I was a kid. I don't think I can rewatch them. I've chosen not to in order to uh, preserve my my fond memories. I never really liked Ernest. I never got the appeal. To be honest, it always I mean. At, 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 at the risk of sounding pretentious, it always seems so sophomoric to me. Well, I mean, it was targeted at 8 to 12 year olds, and that's when I was watching those movies, so. Oh, true, true. And that's about the time I was really getting into stuff like uh, Heinlein and Asimov and. Cole and Tolkien, and I was like, I I, I didn't mind cartoons. Cause cartoons could be sophomore, and I was okay with it. But movies and live action stuff, I was like, oh no, 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 I can't have this. I couldn't possibly watch that. No, 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 no. <laughs>
All right. How are we oh, gonna... droll. <laughs> Scarecrows were fine. Oh, cool. All right. Make sure we're on water next. There we go. Okay, I'm taking everything but the ancient seeds out of the wine. Because... <laughs> no point. No point. Okay. Oh, and we need it. Did anybody say... It, it, did anyone love the animals, or did we forget to love the animals again? I love the animals. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and dump this into this. Okay. Oh, and the other chicken coop is up. We have uh, our incubator. Yeah, incubator's in the main one, so we have to move the some of the animals to the other one. And we can't do that while they're sleeping, I'm assuming. I don't know. Yeah, there's somebody they're trying to sleep. Yeah, it was just like, uh, no. All right. Yams are watered. Woot. Well, it should be ready on fall 18. I just made and uh, set up a whole crap load of, uh, of... Yeah, I saw uh, that. <laughs> of what? Uh, the, lightning uh, rods. Lightning rods. Oh, okay. Very good. And actually, this is going to be our last night of the night, folks. Just as a side note, in case I didn't say that earlier. Well, at least I got the yams. T I did something! Yes. Yes, you did. You did good. I did good. Then I can go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. that okay boom productive night okay so it's one o'clock and Going will she make it i am i'm in my house <laughs> whoa all right so let's see how we did survey says uh Jeez, what do we sell? <laughs> Truffle oil. Starfruit. Starfruit. Oh, keep going. Cheese. Oh. One of these days we have to have a we have to have a six figure day. That'd oh, be you nice. should save some of that goat cheese. Why? For the festival. Oh, I did. Oh, you did? Yeah, we've got uh, goat cheese and a goat cheese and a, 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 an iridium goat cheese and an iridium uh, regular cheese. Look at you. I am. Paying attention. The greatest! Or whatever. <laughs> you know, instead of like, just redecorating your house for an entire episode. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> All right. But... This episode on Lover Listed. All right, so progress has been saved. Day 10 of fall, year two. And it's raining, and we almost hit, went back up to a million. Not quite, but we almost got there. But with that, it's time to close things out for the night. So let's go ahead and move on over to this side. And we'll close out to the calming sounds of rain. Folks, uh, if you are watching on YouTube, thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed. Of course, if you did enjoy, please make sure that you help me out by clicking the like button and commenting on the video. I do try to respond to all the comments, and they do help me out with the YouTube algorithm. So 
any statement, question, thought, comment, criticism are all welcome uh, on there. And make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Make sure you click that notification bell. That way you'll know when new videos come up on the channel. If you're watching here live on stream and you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. You can find links out down in the doobly-doo uh, on the Twitch side. As well, both on Twitch and YouTube in the doobly-doo, you'll find links to all my social media channels. So it's a great way to continue this conversation after we're done here. With that all said, thank you once again for being here. I hope you enjoyed. And until I see you next time, game on, lovelies.